Land Talk. The National Land Agency takes you on an information land guide so that you will always be on solid ground. Let's talk land. Hi Jennifer, long time no see. What's up? Pauline, you're looking good girl. Life has been good to you. Yes my dear, life has been great. Especially since I got my master's degree. I just got promoted at work. I would like to go back to school too, but it costs too much to go to university these days. You try getting a loan from the bank? Yes, but for the amount of money I want to borrow. The bank wants something to secure the loan. Come out of the way, my little kid kid. Lord, we might never even did dare so. Never mind, my dear. Back to what we were saying. You don't have anything you could use as collateral, like a car, house, or piece of land? No, no. The little car I have, it no value much. And I don't have any house or land. Wait. Wait a minute. You know, my mother gave me a piece of land in Hanover. I could use that to secure the loan. Does it have a registered title? The land has to be registered in your name for it to be used as collateral. What do you mean, land has to be registered? That land is in my family from how long, and nobody else can claim it. All right, hear me now. A registered title is a document that proves that you are the owner of the land. If you don't have a registered title for your land, other persons can claim ownership. So how do I get a registered title for this land? I got my land registered three months ago, so I can help you with some information. You say that the land is your mother's land. So the title would have to first be registered in her name and then she transfers the land in your name. She will need to apply to the Registrar of Titles at the National Land Agency to have the land registered. And if it is not the entire land she's given you, but only a portion of it, she will need to first get a subdivision approval from the Parish Council. It is the entire land she has given me, so I'm going to need to get subdivision approval. Where can I get an application form to register the land? You can get the application forms on the National Land Agency's website at www.nla.gov.jn or you can get it from a lawyer. Let me write down the website www.nla.gov.jn Will my mother need to send any documents with the application? She will need any document that proves she owns the land, such as a sales receipt, probated will, common law title or certificate of compliance under the Facilities for Titles Act. If she does not have any document to show that she owns the land, she must get what they call a statutory declaration from two persons who have known the land for at least 30 years. What do you mean by a statutory declaration? A statutory declaration is a written statement confirmed by oath, so the person who knows the land for 30 years would need to confirm it in writing how your mother got the land. Oh, I see. So, if I get these two persons to stand in front of a JP and take the oath and have the document signed, then I have what you call it? A statutory declaration. So those are all the documents she would need to send with the application? No. She would need to show that all the property taxes for the land have been paid up. So she should get a certificate from the Inland Revenue Department. That's it? Is that all? She'll also need a survey diagram showing the boundaries of the land and the neighboring properties. The whole process of getting a title for the first time can be complicated. So it is best that she gets a lawyer. Thanks, Pauline. You sound like a lawyer. You sure you did not study law at university? No, my dear, but that sounds like something I could consider. You take care and all the best. For more information, please call the National Land Agency at 750-LAND. That is 750-5263 or 946-LAND. That is 946-5263. Or visit our website at www.nla.gov.jm.